maybe just get them adjusted. Marion Riki jokes that these high-tech glasses look like something from a sci-fi show. But she isn't fooling around when she says her grandson's invention actually works. Well, the first thing I said was, oh gosh, I can see your faces. <laughs> that ability is something Marion thought she lost with the loss of her central vision. She sought out a similar product in Denver, but those glasses were $15,000. The minute he said, I can make you some of those, I have faith he could do it because he's very clever. This is the charger. With the help of a 3D printer and a Kickstarter campaign, Christopher created magnet glasses. The HD video glasses have a small camera on top connected to a microcomputer. We asked Christopher to hook it up to a projector to show us what Marion sees when wearing the device and how she can control it. She can, you can be black and white, uh, you can be very dark or light. Her peripheral vision can discriminate details if they're big enough. And so this, this allows him to vault the defective areas in her eyes and employ the good, healthy parts of her eyes. And then the brain can take that and put it together and pretty much fill in the blanks. Optometrist John Boyer says Christopher downplays how miraculous this technology is. It really, it really has potential for significant uh, enhancement of quality of life for really millions of people with macular degeneration. I'm very proud of him actually because he sets his mind to it. And right now his mind is set on a bigger vision, making it available for mass production at an affordable price. I see it being um, available for large amounts of people uh, across the world. Reporting at OHSU, I'm Jessica Greif for The Oregonian and Oregon Live.